Hello everyone. Now I'm in the dark forest with Sofern SP10 Pro. Okay, this one here. Okay. Thank you Sofern to send me this flashlight for making a review. Okay. It is not a new flashlight, but um, Sofern wants um, me to make a review about it. Okay. Um, for me, this one is an interesting and a very good um, EDC. Okay. It uses um, 14500 barrier and it also um, compatible with normal AA battery. This is very good. Okay. The LED is, is um, LH351D5000K. Um, for the max lumen here, it says um, it says about 900 lumens. Okay, 900 lumens for um, 14500 battery and 350 lumens for um, AA battery. Okay. Which is very good. Okay. Okay. Here, this one. Um, the way to charge the battery, you have to charge it um, outside, okay, with the external charger, okay. Okay, um, let's walk around and see some beam charts. Okay, here, um, this is SP10 Pro, okay. Um, for me, I prefer to use um, smooth ramping mode, okay, let me show you here. Okay, this is the highest, you see that? Very bright. Wow, really good tin. Okay, LS351D 5000K. Very bright. Okay, smooth ramping mode. Okay, very good. Okay, let me show you step ramping. One, two, three. Here. Okay. It is the um, Andrew 2. Okay, you can um, have and access to turbo just um, by double click something like that okay double click back to go to um, uh, the last memorized brightness something like that okay let me show you the turbo here okay here is um, the turbo mode it is very bright and um, the Andrew UI okay, make this um, flashlight very good because you can um, set the temperature limit of your flashlight it's a small flashlight, but very powerful. Yeah. I really love this one. And if you use um, the AA battery, okay, it's still bright. Okay, um, let me change the battery. Okay. Okay, here is normal berry. Oh, you see that? Not bad at all. Okay. 14500 berry can give you 900 lumens, but this one about 350 lumens. You see that? I use um, web cell, okay, web cell um, rechargeable in IMS berry, 2800 milliamp. Okay. Wow, not bad at all. You can use um, this flashlight okay, to walk around the forest to be um, a backup flashlight. Or you can use it in your everyday life. Okay. It also have um, a magnetic tail cap, okay, but it is not included in, in the box. And also a diffuser for um, SP10 Pro, okay. They are so separately. Here, not bad at all. Okay. Quite bright. Okay. Let me go back to um, lithium ion battery, okay. Okay, now back to lithium ion battery. You see that? Very bright. Very good. Overall, I love this flashlight very much. Okay. And I recommend you if you want um, a small flashlight that is really powerful, you should um, you should buy SP10. Okay, S SP10 Pro. Sorry. Okay, very bright, and um, you can use a AA battery as well. Okay, very good. 
but you must um, understand how to use Android. Okay, for me, I like to use um, the advanced UI. Okay, now it's raining. Oh, very good. This is the turbo mode. I can feel the heat, but not much. I can still hold um, the head. Okay, very good. Um, if talk about things for improvement, um, I think Sofern should make, um, if possible, just add USB-C charging port to the flashlight, okay, or maybe the uh, or maybe the battery, something like that, okay. Now, um, if you buy this flashlight, um, there is um, a charger, okay, external charger to charge the battery, okay. I think. If possible, just add um, USB-C okay, um, to this flashlight okay, or the battery. Um, and um, for the LED, okay, it is not bad at all, but uh, maybe Sofern should provide more options like 4000K, 2700K, something like that. Okay, or um, Nishia 519A, something like that. Okay, that would be great. Okay. Here, very bright, okay, very bright. It may step down but just a little bit, okay. Let me check, I will turn off and turn on again. Here, just a little bit, okay. Still very bright, very good beam. This is why I love Andrew because I can um, set the temperature limit, okay. Very good. And um, thank you so fun again to send me this um, great flashlight. Okay. I hope you will enjoy my review. Thanks for watching.